Hello everybody, welcome back to Corey's Cards. Had a fun month opening a box at the start, promo pack in the middle, and then showing off a couple decks. And now we are opening yet another box to end the month. Fun time for me. Obviously these are probably my favorite video. Well, I like promo pack videos more just because the promo packs are like more fun individually to open. Because the cards look cooler. <laughs> it's that simple. But, um, ooh. But, booster boxes certainly have a lot more. Alright, let's keep it aligned with Itachi. Okay, good luck here. Good luck here. Will we get yet another uh, legendary rare? I certainly hope so. Come on. Oh no. Okay. Theory. Pull all the packs out. Maybe the problem is me. Maybe I should have always done this. Now we do. Nice and gentle like. Nice and gentle like. And hey. Uh, even enough. All right. Bing bong. Let's get some good stuff here. I am actually not using the scissors intentionally. I want to save a couple of these packs. And with the scissors, I end up mopping off the top. All right, everybody. To start. Venom Wave, Zala, Yagador, oh wait, remember, come closer, Edna, Monstrous Will, Small Fry, Lilith, uh, Alt Border Micronic Hatchling, you go to the side there, Hoshiko, a foil tidal vortex. And hey, let me grab my trash can. You think maybe one of these days I will start the video with this next to me. Well, I should say it's a brown paper recycling bag, rather. But yeah, one of these videos I might start with the next to me. I mean, I might just keep getting up every time. Good chance for me to get a stretch in, but you know. Not a lot of point in getting my stretch in three minutes in. Um, okay. Set them. Cool. All right. Second back. Ooh, come on. Man, scissors are easier. Gotta give it to him. I came off like butter. Nightwing. Let me move that there. Okay, cool. Ryu. Doomton. Zavidi. Draconic Intimidation. Belladonna. Oh. Sharp Shade. Draconic Graveyard. Mastrone, which actually, I think this is my first Mastrone outside of the starter, the, the starter deck copy that you get. Like, no cap, my very first one. And, whoa, this looks great in foil, holy shit. Look at that, that's so cool that like his mouth is open and they foiled that out. I don't know why, I just like this one particular foil quite a bit. Okay, I actually need that Mastrone. Um, let me see if I remember to mention this at the end of the video, but it involves that Mastrone. Maybe. It's not like that cool or anything. Um, well, damn, this pack just tore open. Another Venom Wave. Infectious Field. That dude. Edna. 
Dragon Camouflage, Camouflage Siege, Elemental Gathering, another alt bordered Hatchling, Buckeye, and a Foil Astrophanes. Sick. Is that two Foil Rares in a row? I think so. It's good luck. Oh. Let's sleep up this guy. Alright, it's going to kill me if I pinned it, and I'm going to forget, so let's just do it right here in the middle of the video. Little, little break, little extra. Okay. So this, which I need this guy, is my library, my living library. And what it is, is it's a single copy of every card in the set, sleeved up, and they're sorted by... Well, I guess the biggest divisions are the yellow breaks. This is characters, strategies, abilities. And then it's sorted, in these two cases, by turn cost. And then within the turn cost sort, by element. And then within the element sort, alphabetical. So, like, in the case of the zero drops, air would be first. Then fire cards, which are then alphabetical. And then plasma. And the reason I did this is instead of having to use the card search tool online, I can literally just look through the entire set. Now, the one thing is I didn't put the super rares in here because I don't have that many of them. They're kind of in decks or in my binder. Um, so, whatever. They're excluded, but also that takes, what are there, like 16 in the whole set? It takes two seconds to decide which of those you want in the deck. The reason Mastrone's important is... He was a lowly Edna. And now he gets to be upgraded. Oh. Whoa. Nice. Welcome aboard. Cool. Now it's complete. That was literally the one of one card I was missing. Cool. Sorry for that pause. Back to your regularly scheduled opening. Oh. Nightwing. Ryu. Doomton. Zavidi. Draconic Intimidation. Belladonna. Sharp Shade, Draconic Graveyard, Kalil, and a Foil Camouflage Siege. Galiel, Galil. Hmm. Oh. Micromon Shield, Black Wings, Yagador. Uh oh. <laughs> oh man. Die right on screen, right on camera. Nightshade. Abyss Destroyer. Dragon Symbiosis. Water Devil. Night Tentacles. Death Whisper. And a Foil Centurion. Sick. I actually think I have a lot of these, but. You know what? I'm not mad. I'm blessed to have the cards I have. Cool. Next. This back can go in the trash. Let me save that one. Actually, we can go for the previous one, too. Alright. Micromon Shield. Dude, no way. I think I got the same sick ass foil. Centurion. Exal. Trafiki, Monstrous Will, Mimi, Elemental Gathering, Night Tentacles, Marivel, no I didn't, but it's a cool one nonetheless, Draconic Palace, seems like a pretty decent card. Oh, 
So I really only needed to save one anyway. Nightwing, Dash and Kenku, Viper, Zavidi, Micromon Dragon, Dragon, Dragonify, Jesus, Dragon Draco release, Transformative Clash, Draconic Graveyard, oh, Speak of the Devil, nice, and a Foil Quetzal, a lot of Foil Rares in this box, got lucky. Oh, this is weird. Look at that. The heck, that was in the middle of the whole thing. Huh. Huh. Well, I mean, let's so open it from down here. See what we get. Hopefully they're not damaged. Maybe it's super lucky. Maybe it's super lucky, but they're super damaged. Man, that's fucked. Nightwing. Plagueis Aid. Sisvolto. Tarplagueis. Necrosphere. Odessa. Water Devil. Draconic Graveyard, Sferamble, Sf Sf and a Flight Tag. No, and none of them were really messed up. It's a really weird pack. Okay. Right. Yeah, I'm destroying myself. Hungry Ambition, Infectious Field, Lemma, Belarus, Draconic Intimidation, Small Fry, Transformative Clash, Lobarto, hey, nice, Lobarto, a Mascador, and a Dashing Kinku, which looks really cool. <laughs> Got them both. Back to back action. How the hell did I miss my sleeve? Alright. Where'd them skizzies go? It's quicker and quieter. If I can pick them up. Right. Hungry Ambition. Black Wings. That guy. Matilda. Monstrous Will. Leona. Flight Focus, Night Tentacles, Quetzal, and a Foil Venom Wave, which I've certainly got in this card. You know, we haven't gotten a single dang super rare yet. We're uh, at least halfway through, not one. It's supposed to be six per box, so should be living it up. Oh, these are going to be miscut, aren't they? Nope, just him, just slightly. We have the sword, Richie, Viper, Necrosphere, Odessa, Brute Strength, Alt Border, just a few, Scourge of the Sea, and a Foil Brute Strength. Nice. Faint, Plagueisade, Ixal, Belarus, Dragon Promise, Small Fry, Sharpshade, Sasaki, Death Whisper, and there's our first one. Green bordered Raikiri. So I think you only can get green from the set. 
but you can get oh so purples in the decks greens in the set i haven't i don't think i've gotten one the other way yet dang one two three four five six seven eight. 12 packs left and we have five super rares in 12 packs and eat good here Pandemonium, Centurion, Sophie, Belarus, Necrosphere, Small Fry, Sharp Shade, Not a Cornea, Argalia. Oh, dude. Woo! Let's fucking go. Our streak's unbroken. We've literally gotten a legendary. So I guess they're no rarer than the super rares. They're basically the same level of rarity, and they just replace one. Or is it they replace two? So every booster box was six super rares, or one legendary plus five super rares. Legendary cards are pulled at different rates. Sure. And my one box that I got a legendary and I got gypped, because I only got it plus four. But, oh baby. Well, immediately sleeve you up. Nice. Holy crap. Dude, that's sick. I... I have two of each of the legendary rare Kamikos. Oh my gosh. Um, man. So happy now. Now all I'm hoping is that the last three super rares here come all at the like, very end. Let's cool off for a second. Super. Nah, it's not a super bet. Plagueis, Identity, Ryu, Ixal, Draconic Beginnings, Belladonna, Plagueis Reaper, Dr. Royale. Drag Ink Duality, and a Foil Faint. Pandemonium? Oh, let me fix that. Straighten it up a bit. Okay, cool. Infectious Field, Viper, Drafiki. Monstrous Will, Odessa, Transformative Clash, Nanami, Plagueis Mercy, and a Foil Maskador. Nice. Tons of Foil Rares in this box, too. I'm really lucky. Another Pandemonium. Zala, that guy, Nightshade, Necrosphere, Dragon Symbiosis, Brock, Karagas, Micromon Enchantment, and a super rare Zoladar, which I'm always the least happy to get the ones from the starter decks, but you know, that's on me for getting a lot of the starter decks, right? Nice. Um, what's that at? So, one, two, three, right? Yeah. So we should have three more still. And we have like seven, eight packs here. This one ain't one. Way of the Sword. Ryu. Madurta. Edna. Dragon Promise. Dragon Symbiosis. Bartholomew, just a few, Alt Border Irresistible Rapture, and a Foil Doom Tin. Nice. You know, this card feels like just as rare as a regular Irresistible Rapture. It's funny. I think that's my playset of Foil Doom Tins, too. Weird how, like, you'll get three of the same one before you get um, one of another, but, you know, it just works out that way sometimes. I've also gotten a legendary rare in four out of six of my boxes, so I mean complaining. Hungry Ambition, Halil, Svolto, Nightshade, Micromon Dragonfly, Small Fry, Plague's Companion, Intunt, Mascador. Oh dang, dude, I wasn't ready for it. Vivista. Cool. Another super rare one from the decks. Honestly, probably one of the worst super rares, if not the worst in the game right now. 
I don't think he's bad as a card. I just don't think he's, like, at all. There's no way of making him work, because Micromon are not Lightning Air. They're Terra Necro, at least at the moment. Um... So, I mean, he could be better later on, but I don't like him at the moment. Plague of Syringe, Dashing Kinku, Madurta, Iron Scraps, Micromon Dragonfly, Tidal Vortex, Jad, Dragonic Graveyard, Explosive Retort. Dang! This is the starter rare fucking box. I won't complain, you know. Look at this. Look at this box. Oh, wait, I actually did literally get every starter. Oh, my gosh. Okay, right? Yeah. We got all four of the starter rare legendary... Starter deck legendaries. And then we got her. So, was it a good box or a bad box? It's hard to determine, right? Because it's like... I don't need any more of these guys. Except the green border right here. So, I guess I'm happy about him. But, I also got this. I don't know. I think it's a win overall. Let's hurry this the heck up. A few more packs. Recap. Move on with our life. Buried Treasure. Halio. Foro. Nightshade. Dragon Camouflage. Dragon Draco Release. Plague's Reaper. Lobarto. Outlawed. Oh, wow, this is just like the, my very first card I opened, the Foil Hoshiko. What a weird error. That's so cool. So I literally have two cards that came off the exact same, like, production line together. Probably, they were probably, like, right next to each other on a print sheet at one point. Wild. Nightwing, Ryu, Ixal, Edna, Abyss Destroyer, Odessa, Plague's Petrification, Sasaki, Sferamble. Oh, dude! My first Crick Hand! Awesome! Sick! I think I'm only missing uh, the Harem card. It's the only card I haven't gotten otherwise. Wow, I got a Judas before all the super... <laughs> what a fantastic box. Wow. Great content box. Micromon Shield. Zala. Viper. Zavidi, Flight Tag, Camouflage Siege, Brute Strength, Alt Border Justify, Alt Border Irresistible Rip, and a Pirate Crossing. That's three yellow sleeves for me on one pack. The Alt Border cards don't feel particularly rarer than their regular counterpart, but it is cool to note them, and I guess they are slightly more special. It's weird that there's only, like, five of them, though. As opposed to, uh... Yeah, just checking. Alright, two packs left. Doesn't matter. Already got our super rare quota. Let's just get them over with. Venom Wave. Richie. Yaganor. Nightshade. Draconic Intimidation. Tidal Vortex. Arahio. Regular just, whoa, weird. It, oh my gosh, it's almost like the exact same pack, except this was a different card. Yep, it was Private Crossing. It was another foil rare, but these are the regular border instead of the all border, so they can just go in the pile. Outlawed, you get a yellow sleeve. That's so funny. I feel like this box was speaking to me. This box was talking to me as a person. This was like, had so many stories to tell, the messed up pack, 
the rolled card that reminded me of my first rare in my first pack. Oh, dude, this is so cool. Hungry Ambition. Halile. Viper. Matilda. Dragon Promise. Small Fry. King Gunner. Plagueis Obscurity. Dragon Charge. And a Foil Quetzal. Man, dude, we got more Foil Rares than we got any other Foil. I like that the Foil slot's truly random, like, rarity-wise. Just complete, uh... Crap shoot. Alright, let me uh sort this like so. Get it so the supers are all in the back. Real quick here. Foil foil I'm gonna move this and just kinda drop them into it, huh? Foil Doomton. This isn't gonna work so well. All bordered irresistible rapture. Kind of see it. Foil Mascador. Foil Faint. Alt Border Just a Few. Foil Brute Strength. Foil Venom Wave. Foil Dashing Kinku. Flight Tag. Quetzal. Draconic Palace. Centurion. Camouflage Siege. Alt Border Hatchling. Foil Astrophanes. Foil Dragon Charge. Ooh. Alt Border. Micronic Hatchling, Tidal Vortex, Quetzal, Outlawed, Alt Border Just a Few and Rapture, Pirate Crossing, Arahel, and then our Super Rares, one of each of the deck supers with the Green Border Drakiri, Krakon, and then another Legendary Rare, Kimiko. Thanks for watching, guys. Until next month.